In this video, the Wild Tube will bring a few stories from the medical center of the Elephant Transit Home at Giratale, located on the north central part of Sri Lanka. The Department of Wildlife and Conservation in Sri Lanka takes an immense effort to protect, treat, and conserve the rich Sri Lankan biodiversity. Apart from treating the injured wild animals in their wild jungle, some are hospitalized and treated. Once they are cured, they are re-released into the wild. This little deer is one of the four true deer species in Sri Lanka known as barking deer, or the muntjac. This species is distributed throughout the country and is the smallest deer of the four deer species. This innocent barking deer has an injured hind limb. If untreated in the wild, such wounds are likely to get infected, worsening the case. Having such injuries impair the deer's movement significantly, which increases the likelihood of becoming victimized by predators such as leopards. Therefore, treating such an innocent fellow in the jungle as for the elephants is not an option, and they are hospitalized and treated in the wild animal hospital until recovery. Therefore, the veterinary team at this hospital not only attends to cases in the wild, but also treats the in-house patients like this little barking deer.
The Sri Lankan spotted deer is a subspecies of the spotted deer species found in southern Asia. As in the case of the barking deer, spotted deer are also treated in the hospital. All these treatments are done free of charge to these innocent creatures in the wild. The department veterinarians and officials render their maximum capability to treat the Sri Lankan wildlife. For example, this spotted deer has been provided with intravenous fluids and recommended medications while providing both veterinary and emotional care. Handling delicate creatures such as these deer has to be done with caution, as it is easy for them to get stressed due to their overwhelming fear, which can even cause a heart attack. Therefore, treating wild animals requires a lot of consideration and empathy, apart from technical knowledge. The ETH Medical Center will release these wild fauna once they are fit to go so that they can carry on their ordinary life away from humans in good health. Look how happy these deer are to get back home. Yeah, I'll tip you. 